Hello, this is Average Alex. Still waiting on Fallout 4, as usual. But, in the meantime, Minecraft Story Mode came out from Telltale Games. We have made popular games such as The Walking Dead, Game of Thrones, Wolf Among Us, Borderlands, that one series that I haven't played yet, um, Sam and Max, stuff like that. Kind of light gameplay, heavy story stuff. And now it's dealing with Minecraft, which is just about gameplay. The actual Minecraft game. So, story mode is going to be pretty interesting. I'm excited. Are you excited? You're not there. It's just me. I'm excited. Alright, me. Let's do this. Oh. Oh, character customization. I dig it. I guess we'll go with... The woman, person, man, I don't know, it's pretty ambiguous. Whatever. Start episode one, because I can't do episode two. Because episode one came out just recently. Today, maybe? Tuesday? I don't know. This game series adapts to choices you make. Story is tailored to how you play. Nothing built can last forever. And every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures on a bridge as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have so long ago four heroes such as these. Gabriel the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Soren the Architect, builder of worlds and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? It's me. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have uh, any weapons or uh, chicken-sized zombies, so zombie-sized chickens, zombie-sized chickens. The giant chickens. I am a not woman. Not because I want to, or because I think it would be easy. It's not ambiguous because anymore. Because they would be an abomination. Imagine their giant feet. Like I said, <laughs> an abomination. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof, mm -hmm. and if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us? Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird the pig to disapproves. everywhere you go? No. He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. He's my wingman. People always want to talk to the girl with the pig. You mean talk exactly. about the girl with the pig? Both. Like, look at the weird girl with the weird pig? I think it works How in my weird. favor. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just... Olivia. It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Fine. That's... Sure. Do you hear that? Strategy. Oh, no. Boom! Ah! Ah! Oh, yeah. 
if I don't. You guys totally freaked out. That was uh... Axel, what's the matter with you? Oh, it's a badass Great. name. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. That's what you get, Axel. I brought you good times and now I'm being punished for it? You scared us half to death. Nothing is fun if you're not scared half to death. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's gotta wear a costume. Ender Dragon Pig. <laughs> He looks awesome. It only took me like a million hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. See, now he's your wingman. Stop. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Get okay. Out. Oh, I'm moving. Gabriel the warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? Oh, it's not impossible. Yeah. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Yeah. Mm, probably not. But we'll go ahead and say yeah. Uh, flint and steel, not too shabby. I but uh, well, maybe? I don't know. You, you say not too shabby, I say you could do better. I got the stand as a gift, but I don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. Give me a dragon war, Reuben. Not half bad for a pig. That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. Hey, that'll do pig reference. I'll do that. Or I guess do that. I don't know. Uh... One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, Hey, there goes Jesse and Reuben, winners of the Endercon building competition. Uh-huh. Shears. Definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. Huh. Poor sheep. Let's go. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one. The special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the Warrior, him freaking self. Whoa. What's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose, but if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally. He's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So, Dead dragon pig. does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my hmm. uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Reuben oh. with us. We basically have no chance. Faith. Olivia. Yeah, come on. What? Believe in a the slice. believe in the a us sliver. that believes in you. A portion. Just a little faith. That's all we need. What is what also, that smile? I'm hungry. To win. To win. No, no, I'm with that. No, seriously, Olivia, what's up with that smile? Wait a minute. That was weird. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. You have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. You might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Enderman than Creepers. They both have their moments. 
were both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. Let's build an Enderman. Yeah, Enderman. Uh, Olivia's oh, you'll get over it. Are you it. whining? No, I was saying awesome. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Yay. You think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. Overconfidence is unbecoming. Dare to prepare on three. Nope. Preparing is daring. Nope. That's the same thing. Uh-oh. Forget it. Team on three. One, two, three. Team. Prepare. Let's go grab items in an awesome fashion. Yeah! <laughs> Dragon Ball Z that tree. Uh, oh, what, what are we doing? Are we really doing put Minecraft? Oh. Uh. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> wow! Why is it my Minecraft like this? I need more of this in my Minecraft. I need more Rocky uh, uh, montages in my Minecraft. Oh, no, no more. Oh my god, lady, you are going to town. <laughs> This is the best. This is what I imagine every Minecraft section I do is. Just not that as exciting. It's more slower and less exciting. Yeah! We know what we're building. We've got all the stuff for it. We are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build. I feel like I'm you're ready. setting us up for defeat, but... Nice pig, I, losers. Oh. Well, that ended fast. Oh, great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Not the Ocelots! Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. Do we have the snakes? So cool. Well, well, well. Or the bosses? It isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please. Axel. And, uh, how do you do? No, your team name. <clears throat> team name? Uh-oh. We are not ready for this. So much for losing anonymously. We're the Dead Enders. Whoa. Uh, Sounds like a name for pirates. It's cool. Okay, Dead Enders. You guys are in booth five. Ha ha ha, you got stuck in a fence. Ha 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 ha. We're laughing at you for that. Isn't it funny? What shall we build for our epic thing that we're gonna build? An Enderman thingy. This is gonna be fantastic! Maybe. I don't know. We'll probably lose. I hope not, but we'll probably lose. Yes, I see you over there. I'll be there in a second. 